Hey, what is up everybody? I'm Star Lord, and today's video we have some pretty awesome information about Fallout 4, Skyrim Special Edition, and the Nintendo Switch. And all of this information comes from an official interview with Todd Howard, in which he actually then discussed mobile gaming, the Nintendo Switch, virtual reality, Skyrim Special Edition, and Fallout VR, which is very awesome indeed. So yeah, a lot to talk about, and it's gonna be pretty awesome. Okay, so starting off with the actual interview itself, the person asking Todd the question started off with kind of polite ones, you know, just asking him about, you know, what he's been up to and everything like that. And then as the interview went on, he started getting into the greasy details, you know, the good stuff that people want to hear about. Now, I'm going to pretty much start from the end of the interview as that is pretty much where all of this great information is coming from. So, first of all, the actual interview viewer asked, do you want to make Elder Scrolls and Fallout games for the rest of your life? And Todd then replies, in some respects, yes, they are worlds that we really love. I would be sad if we stopped. We want to do other things as well, but those worlds are really part of who I am. We make little games too, like Fallout Shelter. We have some other mobile games that we are starting to look at. We can try some things that we wouldn't usually do with the larger games. Then the interviewer asked, so you have more mobile games on the way? And Todd then replies with, we definitely do, yes. So that is pretty awesome information for everybody who really enjoyed Fallout Shelter. As most of you guys probably know, Fallout Shelter was a huge success on the mobile gaming platform. And I think Bethesda were really happy about that. You know, they got some extra revenue and a lot of people got to play one of their favorite franchises in their mobile, which is pretty cool. I know I enjoyed it and I know people still play it to this day. And you, you know, you cannot deny this. When you watch the E3 footage where he actually announces that it is available there and then, you can see people in the crowd getting their phones out to go and download it. I mean, the hype was unreal. And yeah, it just doesn't really surprise me that Bethesda wants to create more mobile gaming uh, applications because, you know, that is kind of where the money is at. I mean, Sony is doing it now, and sure enough, Xbox will be doing it soon too. I mean, Nintendo's already at it with the Super Mario Run series, which is pretty awesome, and it's good to see that Bethesda are actually getting into this. Uh, so let's move on to the next interview is question. This game is coming out on the App Store tonight. Now here the interviewer says to Todd, what do you think of the Switch, Nintendo's newly announced console that is portable but also hooks up to your TV? In which Todd then replies, I love it. I got to play it. I will tell you, well, maybe that's an NDA thing, one of the best demos I've ever seen. Probably the best demo I have ever seen at E3. So... That is pretty big news, I mean, that's pretty big words from someone who who has one of the most successful game franchises out there. I mean, Nintendo, what are you guys doing over there? I cannot wait to see the full reveal of this console, of the power that it actually possesses, which games will actually come at launch, and obviously, you know, if Todd likes it, then I'm assuming most of you guys are here because you like the Fallout and the Elder Scrolls series, then you will probably, most surely, like it too. But let's get back to the interview question. Uh, after Todd said that, the interviewer then said, was it a Nintendo game? And he says, I mean the device itself. I think it's really smart what they're doing. We're definitely going to be supporting it. It's the first time we've done something on Nintendo if you don't count the old NES stuff. Home Alone or Where's Waldo? And then the other guy asks, can you really bring Skyrim with you on the go? And Todd then replies, it's the same game on the TV and on the other screen. So this is pretty awesome information. First of all, this is fucking awesome information.
So, again, he's actually said this is the first time we've done something on Nintendo if you don't count the Nintendo Entertainment System stuff. So, I'm assuming that even though a couple of weeks ago Bethesda said, whoa, whoa, slow your guns here, Skyrim might or may not, may or may not be coming to the Nintendo Switch. Well, I would pretty much say that is a yes, it is coming to the Nintendo Switch. And if it's not, you can bet your ass that there will be definite Bethesda test the games on that console. Probably I'm thinking more along the lines of Fallout Shelter will definitely be on it because it just kind of suits that kind of console, you know, it's kind of aimed at kids and I can imagine a lot of kids like those type of games. But not only that, this sparks a lot of controversy around the other games that Bethesda actually work on, such as the new IPs that are coming out, Dishonored, even Doom. I would love to play Doom on that portable handheld device. That would be absolutely insane, especially online. That would be so sick. I would just love it. All of that information aside, we now know that Bethesda will be putting a little bit of time and a little bit of effort into the new Nintendo Switch console, which is very awesome for gamers such as me, because I mean, I just love Fallout and Skyrim games or Fallout and Elder Scrolls games, but I also love those type of games where you can only play them on the Nintendo, such as Zelda, Mario, Pokemon, those type of games. So the fact that, you know, Bethesda games will in fact probably be coming to the Nintendo Switch console has made me a very happy gamer indeed. And if it has made you guys happy too, make sure to comment in the comment section if you are going to get the Nintendo Switch. Anyway guys, thank you very much for watching this video. I do hope that you have an awesome day and until until next time, I've been Star Lord. I'll see ya.